question number 5 which says by traveling at 40 km per hour a person reaches his destination on time if he covers two third of the total distance in one third of the total time what speed should he maintain for the remaining distance to reach his destination on time okay it's a uh, similar to the previous question what is said here is he covers two third of the total distance let's take the fact in what time 1 by 3 two third of the time so what is the distance left that is one third of the distance left which has to be covered in two third of the time so in the previous question as we have seen that there are two methods to answer this question the one is time can be expressed as an 3x because the total parts are three parts this one part in the first case in the second case two parts therefore the time is uh, total three parts so I can take the time as 3x and the speed is given 40 km per hour so what is the distance so distance is equal to speed into time that is 120 so 120 x this is what the distance is okay I'll go with the first method first now two-third of the distance what is two-third of the uh, 120 so 120 x into 2 by 3 this gets cancelled 40 times 40 into 2 that is 80 in the first case it's a uh, 80 x is covered and what time? One third of the total time. And the time is 3x. One third of 3x is x. So the time is x. Now what is the time uh, distance left out of 120? If 80x is over, I left with 40x. So 40x has to be covered in the remaining time. And what is the remaining time? The total time is 3x. 3x minus x it's a 2x so this is the time and we know that speed uh, this is distance distance by time is equal to speed so what it is said is what speed should he maintain for the remaining distance so to reach the destination on time therefore speed is equal to 40x by 2x so xx gets cancelled this is 20 so 20 kilometer per hour this is method 1 now come here second method what is the distance to be covered one third of the distance to be covered in what time two-third of the time and distance by time is equal to speed so let's take that speed is equal to 1 by 3 by 2 by 3 now which comes that's 3 by 2 so you get cancelled this is 1 by 2 what is this 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 part of the original speed has to be followed to reach the destination on time so original speed is 40 so therefore 40 into 1 by 2 which is equal to 20 kilometer so per hour this is the speed has to be mentioned maintained so I request you to again go through this second method which is a much uh, less calculation or simple over the first one